All right, violas, this is your last section. You're almost done with the whole piece. So we're going to start at measure 39 and go all the way to the end of the song. Uh, so 39, we go into a faster rustic section. Uh, and this is definitely a dance. Um, you can totally picture someone doing like a country dance to this. Uh, and you have two rhythms, basically, that are going on here. Um, the first one uh, is, if I just do it on open D, is measure one going one and three. One and three, like that. Sometimes you do it separate bow, sometimes you do it hooked. Uh, and then skip over and take a look at, um, actually let's do it without the hook bow. Look at measure 47. Uh, actually this is kind of the same thing. One and three, and that's not a big deal. It was 48, look at 48. This one he inverts that rhythm. So we're going one and two and long, short, short, long for, uh, for the rhythm there. So here we go at 39. You've got some hook bows to look at. Uh, make sure you're hooking. Uh, where they have the dots, like keep things short. And other than that, there's not too much to this, to this section. So here's 39. We're going to pause when we get up to 55. All right, so here's 39. One, two, three, four, five, six. if you put some slashes in so you know where big beat one and then the next big beat two is or if you're counting in six beat one and beat four um, if you notice at 42 and then there's another measure too 42 and 46 you get some straight up syncopation um, well I guess it, you know we're not in four four times so technically it isn't syncopated but you're going one and four and short long long short okay so be just be careful he, he likes to really play around and, and jump between, uh, you know, your long, short versus the short, long, which makes it interesting and kind of fun. All right, so now we're moving on to 55. Meno moso, less motion. We're slowing down a little bit. This is very similar to what we did at 20. Uh, so let's do that part. So we're going 55 up to 67. Again, some high threes to worry about, some grace notes coming up, but it's pretty much the same thing as what you did at 20. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> I slow down through those last four notes, the rallentando. And here we go. Here's the very last part at 67 to the end. Uh, before we do this, let's skip all the way down to the end and take a look at measures 77 and 78. Uh, so this stuff is kind of similar to what you had way at the beginning. If you look at measure 14, uh, the same rhythm is happening at 77. So let's take a look at that. Again, I suggest using a fourth finger. But here's 77. One, two, and three, four, five, six. <laughs> Okay, let's try it again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so now we've got measure 78. Uh, same deal with the hook bow. It's, again, similar to 15, but a little bit different. So here's three even eighths. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. And just put that little pause in your bow for that double up bow. Okay, I think you're ready. Let's do 67 to the end. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs>
we'll slow down at the end of nice big retardando and then hold that last note. So especially those last two lines, go over that a couple more times. The fingers move a little quicker then. Uh, but otherwise, pretty song, nice smooth legato bowing. So work on that uh, and happy practicing. <laughs>